Hello world, this is the 25th JavaScript tutorial. In the tutorial, we will talk about rest and spread operator for objects. So last time, we will talk about rest and spread in the array. We will talk about the rest and spread in the video tutorial. Objects are going to use the rest and spread. Okay, so we can say that objects are going to use the rest and spread. We can use the rest and spread operator. Already object like information available to you, we can use the rest operator. So first, the spread operator. Suppose if I already have an object defined, Charles is name and age. So suppose I have to add a work location here, and I have to add a work position here. That's why I use the spread operator. So now, I have to replace the array. Okay, now I am going to equalize the manual here, otherwise I am going to use the side effects of the spread operator and I am going to automatically replace the charge. Now I am going to equalize the manual here, okay, great. So now I am going to add the work up to the work. So what is the work? Software, software engineer, okay. So this is my work. So now Charles has the work information. If you already have defined information, what do you want to use? Obviously, spread operator. Great. So this is the spread operator. Okay. Now I run it. Okay. So now I don't have to lock console, but if you want to test it, I test it. I first have the card. Okay. See? Name Charles is page and work software engineer. If you work on this, you can serve the web page in the live server. I have already used the live server in the initial stage of the videos. So, if you serve the live server in the live server, you can load the page. So, if you have variables and public or all of these things, you can use the Chrome developer tool. That's why you can use the Charles in the public variable. You can use the console in the console. You can use the Chrome mode features in the Chrome mode. Okay, great. Now, that is the most important thing in the tutorial. Now, let's go to REST operator. Okay, we have already seen the spread operator. Okay, so when you see REST operator, when you compare arrays and objects, REST operator is a little flexible. Right? Okay, last time we were talking about arrays, right? Now, REST operator is defined as a pin, and then we can go to the next one. Now, there is a sickle downside, right? That downside is a little bit less than the objects. Right? That downside is a little bit less than the objects. Right? That downside is a little bit less than the objects. Okay, now I'm going to cut it. First I'll let, I'll put it in the curly braces and you can add the information to the object. Okay, so let, okay. In the curly braces, you can add the information to the object. That is defined. Now, you can add the age to the object. So, what do you do? Just define the term. Now, what is the name of the key? Age. So, in that name, I'm going to define a variable. I'm going to use it as an assignment. So, now you can lock the console lock. Even if you want to go to Chrome, you can lock the console lock. So, now you can lock the console lock. That's why you can lock the age of 26. Right? Suppose you want to lock the name. Then, you can lock the name. So, now you can lock the name. Name. Okay? So, Charles Dillip, 26. Suppose you have a name, now you can use work as well as 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 you can use work. अपने और वेरिएबल नहीं ला, आधा नार्डा मार ला, तो ये पनींगे वर्क अपनींगे रविशे तो प्रिंट पनींगे ना, इधर तो सॉफ्टवेयर इंजीनियर 26 अपनी ने इधर वर्क को में एजेंट वरम, राइट असो इधर रोम्बा भी फ्लेक्सिबल, इधर लवंद निंगे एन्ना पोजीशन लवंद फर्स्ट लवंद कार्डिस लवंद अपनींगे रेंडा विषय मुख्य Name, right? So maybe rest is name. Save it. Yes, great. So this is the rest and spread operators for objects. Right? Okay, great. So now we are almost in the 25th video. So in the first video, in the 25th video, we have a question for you. Please subscribe to the channel. Maybe if you think this video is useful, if you think this video is useful, please share it with us. So, we will use our community. And, we will use it as a user. Okay? Thank you.